To complete this section, we are going to use some commands specially made for sections. First of all, we are going to enhance the water. We type W, I, E for waves in elevation and select the green helpline that represents the level of the water. After confirming the selection and the command settings, we see a wave pattern appearing on the line we selected. We undo this wave pattern and run the command again. This time we don't click the line but enter a P. By typing a P, we select the previous selection, a native AutoCAD option. In the main menu of the command, we now tap an H to change the height. When we confirm the settings this time, we see the waves are a bit higher. With Lay ISO, we isolate the waves and the contour lines. Boundary is a native AutoCAD command and allows us to create an outline of an area defined by linear entities. When we click in this area, a closed polyline is created. After we select the layer to hatch water width, we hatch the closed polyline. We don't select the closed polyline though, we just type an L and we select the last created entity, which is the closed polyline. Now the water is hatched, we send it to the back and continue with the slopes. On these slopes, we want to draw grass. There are plenty of grass blocks, but they often need to be shortened, extended, they grow perpendicular to the line, not to mention to place them on curved entities. By typing G, I, E for grass and elevation, we only have to select the green helpline. We use the default settings for the left slope, so we hit enter to continue. For the right slope, we enter a P for presets and enter 11 for wild grass. After confirming, we see a different configuration of grass. Finally, we are going to place reed at the water sides. We do this by typing R, I, E. When we run the command on the left side and use the default settings, we see a reed appearing. It's not the species we want though, so we undo the command and run it again on the same line. In the main menu, we enter an S to change the species. We'll also place read on the right side. In the main menu we type an E for element ratio. We set it to 30 and when we hit enter the command places read that it's twice as dense as the left side. With a few actions we added a lot of detail to our section. As long as the commands are stamped with the social download stamp, you can download them for free and try them out. Find the links in the post. Enjoy!